All right, what's going on guys? Jay that drain day. As you guys can see, the bathtub is backed up. So, this is one of those units that we have a lot of issues with. So, what we need to do is, basically, the setup is, it traps, and then it tees, and then where the T is, just after that, the other trap is. So, for next door. The problem is, we keep jumping the T and go next door. So we need to now cut open here and find the vent, and the vent will go down and go right in between the T and clear the blockage. So we're gonna end up cutting open a hole here and cutting the pipe. Actually, the pipe should already be cut. There should be a coupling on there. Jay. Yeah. Yeah, man, it is funny. I guess it's good, man. Um, because as soon as, as soon as you turn that water on, right away it went in there. Yeah, because right? it's backed up in the T. Yeah. So that's why yeah. we're gonna do this, but. But it's for yourself, eh? It's for your own thing, eh? Yeah. How's that going? Not bad. Yeah? Yeah. It gets you busy, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'll let you be, just take a picture sent to me, and you're a gentleman, man. Will do. Good. Cheers. Okay. And just so you guys know, nothing is wrong with the toilet, nothing's wrong with the bathroom sink, it is literally just in the tea of the bathtub. This stuff will cut you super easy. So, you guys can see my coupling there. That's because I had to do this in the past. <clears throat> All right, so I basically got it propped out. So now we got to snake down and that should clear this. So we're gonna be using the Milwaukee today, like always. You know, if there's anybody at Milwaukee that wants to sponsor these things, I'd be more than happy to let them. More than happy. We're going to be using our Watson gloves. We have our Grease Monkey gloves. We used our Milwaukee saw. We used our Milwaukee screwdriver. We have the shower running, just so that we can... I got the mic right up to it. So we're gonna work this area back and forth. Because we come here, 
and try to jump the trap or jump the tee so many times and just can't get through to it. And then the management puts acid down and it just, it's not something you should be doing. I never recommend acid, but this is one of those places that they didn't want to open up the wall again, so they just wanted us to keep dropping off acid to them. But it was plugging up every couple months. Just so you guys see, we don't see nothing because the lens is all foggy. But the water's all gone from the bathtub. If you guys like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe if you haven't. And you know what, even if you don't like the video, subscribe. And then come on every video and tell me how much you don't like it. So, just got some hair. We're gonna go back in. Let's pull it back out. Put that whirlpool down there, and that's what we're looking for. So, this pipe that was cut was the vent. And this was done about a year and a half ago. So we're gonna tell them to put some sort of access panel here because we gotta have it so that when this happens again, Alright, so battery's getting hot.
camera's getting hot, whatever. So this is where I'm gonna leave it. Sorry about that, guys. This is where we're gonna leave it. Until next time, let me know how I did and what you guys would have done different. And until next time, thanks for watching. This has been Jay That Dream Guy signing out. Tarogna.